to get to a thousand is just absolutely unbelievable. Our names are Mike and Heather. We're traveling the US in our van Appa on a mission to visit all 50 states. Subscribe and join us as we try to figure out this whole van life thing. Thanks for watching. So we have some unbelievably exciting news and I say unbelievable because for us it definitely is. Shortly before the end of the year, we actually hit for us a crazy YouTube milestone. I don't know the best way to say it, but we hit a thousand subscribers, which I, I guess for a lot of people, that's just one of the, the things you just get to. But for us, we really didn't have an expectation to ever get there. When we started making these videos, we thought that they would be really cool to be able to share our adventures with our family and friends. And as we started posting them online, more and more people started to subscribe and to get to a thousand is just absolutely unbelievable. I think that the ultimate hope when you post a video on YouTube is that you'll eventually one day make it big to a thousand subscribers, but we really had no real expectations or even thought that that would be possible for us. We're just two random people who decided to convert a van and pick up a camera. <laughs> so for us to th know that there's so many people who are actually interested in our little lives here, we're really honored and flattered to just be part of your lives even in this very small way. And the biggest thing that we can say is thank you. Thank you for watching. Thank you for taking a chance on such a small channel with a lot of growing pains, including poor lighting at some times, poor audio, and just really no direction in knowing what we're doing. We really do appreciate each and every one of you you're what got us here and we can't say thank you enough. Going off of that, it's been so cool just in having this channel to interact with so many of you in the comment section, to share van ideas and, and build thoughts and, and different ways to, to do things. And then to just get to know some of you through seeing the names kind of pop up over and over has been, has been really awesome. This whole experience was something that we never expected to have. We thought it would be really cool to, to try van life. <laughs> and it's just been so, so amazing. We've, we've loved being on the road. We've loved working on the van and we've really found that we enjoy making these videos for YouTube. It, it's just been such a cool experience to have the opportunity to do. The comment section is one of our favorite things to go through after a video just because of the community aspect behind it. Hearing that we have people from literally all over the world watching us is just so incredibly mind-blowing. We've had people comment from Australia, Germany, the UK, Pakistan, and then even some right in our backyard who we've never met before who somehow stumbled upon our channel. So it's just utterly amazing to us. We're just incredibly thankful for not only being able to take advantage of those comment sections for our own van builds and all the great suggestions you have, but that other people are also getting a lot out of it. So it's just amazing to see even with such a small community how big of an impact this has. A thousand in the grand scheme of things of, of some of those really big channels doesn't really mean a whole lot, but within kind of the YouTube system, it's actually cool because that along with a couple of other milestones, including watch hours and, and some of those other things, actually puts you into the next level of YouTube creators where YouTube will actually start giving you a cut of ad revenues on top of just the amazingness of getting to a thousand people following and watching our videos, we'll actually be able to start using some of the revenue from YouTube to put towards our adventures and our travel. So we have you all to thank for that as well. For those of you who don't know, like we didn't know when we started this channel, we knew that you could somehow make money in the mystical realm of YouTube. But for us, we really didn't have a clear idea of like how it all worked. So a brief overview is you need a certain amount of watch hours, which is 4,000 watch hours, as well as a certain amount of subscribers, which is 1,000 subscribers. And thankfully, because of you all, we've hit both. So the next big step is really applying to be monetized. So we're really excited about that and seeing what happens there. <laughs> we're not anticipating making any big bucks, but hey, if we can fill up a gas tank and it leads us somewhere else, then that's enough for us. <laughs> Going off of that really exciting news of a thousand subscribers, we actually have some more life updates that we want to share with you all and really where 2022 is going to take us. One of the other things that we've been looking into is remote work to try a sort of digital nomad lifestyle to not be grounded in one place and to be able to travel a lot more. In the new year, we actually both have left our previous positions and are now <laughs> working remotely, which hopefully is going to allow us to be on the road a lot more and we're really excited to share that adventure with you of transitioning from being in our, our apartment, which you can see around us, to <laughs> living more kind of continuously out of APA and trying to figure out how to how to have a work-life balance on the road and traveling and doing all that. So all of that is really exciting and 
contributing to a 2022 that we're really looking forward to. I actually just put in my two weeks a couple of days ago, so it's still very much overwhelming and very exciting, but there's all the apprehension and kind of, I guess, emotions that go along with it. So January 18th will be my official first day as a full-time remote worker, so we're very excited. We really don't know what 2022 is gonna bring for us. We just know what type of lifestyle that we're wanting and hopefully are making strides to get there. I feel like a lot of people at this point when they do start a van life channel already kind of have it all figured out and to be honest we're just kind of stumbling through what it looks like to be in van life to want to work remotely and have that digital nomad life and to play around with YouTubes. This is all a very much a big learning experience for us and we are not experts in YouTube van life or digital nomad life, but we're very excited to see what it all has in store. We have a couple of goals for our YouTube channel and for this kind of van life experience that we're really excited about kind of pursuing moving forward. So we've already talked about wanting to travel to all 50 states and to visit as many of them in APA as we yes. can. <laughs> I think we've hit 16 so far yeah. between our different road trips. And hopefully we'll be able to move a little bit slower going forward now mm -hmm. that we'll actually be able to work out of it. Previously, we both had to be in the office and only really had two weeks or three weeks off at a time where we could fit in a bunch of stuff. So I'm really excited to be able to travel slower and, and really soak in all those other states. Yeah, and really to be able to experience van life more fully. With that, we are hoping to kind of, I guess, launch a few new things to go along with the YouTube channel. The first one, we're going to try and have an Instagram page. <laughs> Neither Heather or I are any good at social media. Um, yes. Our Instagrams and Twitters and Facebooks are completely barren. We almost never post, but we figure that'll be a cool opportunity to share some some things that maybe don't make it into the video or just to give you all some updates on, on where we are a little bit more in real time. Yeah. So that's gonna be something exciting and it's something that we haven't done before. So it'll be a neat, learning experience. Yeah, we've really kind of enjoyed YouTube as almost like a project to get excited about because as I'm sure a lot of you can relate, during the pandemic there wasn't really a lot going on or to really look forward to. So this channel and building out the van was something that really excited us and kind of gave us a purpose during that time when it felt like everything was kind of crumbling around us to really have something that we were happy and excited about doing. With that, we're really just kind of wanting to expand off of that and think that the Instagram page will also be a fun little project to be able to do. And that actually leads us into our second kind of update that we're wanting to do as far as kind of the social media YouTube side of what, what we're doing here, which is starting a website. We've gotten some questions on different aspects of our travel that we wanted to be able to go a little bit more in depth on. So we'll hopefully be posting blogs fairly regularly, talking about things like our budget on certain trips, things to, to look out for, and then just some of our experiences that we can delve a little bit deeper on. So it's it's not gonna be a huge thing, but something we're excited to, to do to have more ways to share some of our, our experiences with everyone. We've gotten so many great questions in the comments and we feel like sometimes we really just can't do it justice or maybe are like the weirdos who are writing like a novel in response to like one simple question. So we really feel like this is gonna allow us to be able to expand deeper into some of those questions that we keep getting and do them a little bit more justice and have a little bit more information behind them. And so I think that kind of leads us into our, our last thing that we're going to try and be better at moving forward and that's more specifically with our YouTube channel, and that's getting on a regular upload schedule. Once we're on the road, we'll have a little bit more opportunity to be out and about and filming some of the things in our adventures with Appa, and we wanna make sure that we can share those kind of consistently because right now, we're, we're doing the best we can. So we're gonna be posting once a week, every Sunday to start off with. And that's just to kind of get the ball rolling and get our feet wet in our new jobs. During this transition period, it'll be once a week. We hope to be able to do twice a week, so Wednesday and Sunday, which was kind of like our goal, but then we would start getting kind of late and not <laughs> edit a video, and then it'll come up at like Thursday night at midnight. So. We're starting off once a week, every Sunday, and then hopefully as we become more comfortable in our new life and lifestyle, we'll move to two a week. But for now, plan on seeing us every Sunday. <laughs>
I think that's kind of what we wanted to jump on and share with you all. We have some trips planned for the beginning of the year, which is really nice. So we're gonna be able to get out early into January. We do have a couple weeks off before we start our new jobs. We do have some family matters to tend to, but the second week in January, we are going to be going on a trip. We'll be able to take you along for that. And then again, hopefully start getting our feet wet in our new jobs and then be able to be more adventurous and on the road for longer times rather than just a week's vacation. <laughs> That kind of brings us to the end of where we are with this video. We just wanted to jump on and, and share this exciting news with you all because you're all the ones who have made this possible. Yes, we really do appreciate each and every one of you. Every time we got a new subscriber, Mike and I'd be like, we got one more, we got one more, because it is just so exciting. And then to think that it's not just a number and you, it's like a real person who clicked that button, it was just so mind blowing to us. So we really do truly appreciate each and every one of you. When you like, comment and subscribe it really does help our small channel grow and we're just forever grateful for this experience and to be able to share it all with you and if you're wondering why we're currently in our apartment living room and not in appa it's because we're not on a trip right now like i said we're really trying to get the ball moving and get everything in order before we really take advantage of our remote living and it is also snowing outside so we decided to do this in the warm comfort of our living room. So with that, again, we really just want to continue to say thank you to all of you. And we're going to continue faking it till we make it on this whole YouTube thing. And we really appreciate you guys being patient with us and taking an interest in our random little lives here. And again, can't thank you enough. We're both just super excited to see where our travels go and to see what we can do with this YouTube channel. So we want to wish you all a happy new year. We're really <laughs> excited to share what we hope will be a fantastic 2022 with all of you. So thank you again for watching. We really appreciate it.